Two people are facing charges this afternoon after a shot was fired inside a residence hall at North Carolina A&T State University. It happened on the second floor of Barbie Hall around 1130 last night. An Aggie alert was sent a short time later. And investigators say that shot was actually fired, went through a wall and into a room of students. Fox 8's Elijah Skipper talked to a student who lives in that building, joins us live from outside Barbie Hall with more now. Elijah. University officials say only one shot was fired into a room on the second floor of this building. They say that a, this argument stemmed from a male student in an argument with his girlfriend. 19 year old Jayla Gibson, who's not a student at the university, is now charged with felony possession of a weapon on educational property, as well as felony firing a weapon into an occupied dwelling. 18 year old Nicholas McCall, a student at NCANT State University, is also being charged with felony possession of a weapon on educational property, among other offenses. He lives in the room where the shot was fired from. University police say that shot went through a wall and into a room occupied by several students, but did not hurt anyone. Today, I spoke with students who live in Barbie Hall. My mom is one of them moms. She like she has Aggie alert system, so she called me instantly right after she saw it. My friends that don't live in the dorm were texting me, so it was kind of that panic of like people trying to make sure I was all right. University police are hoping to remind students that weapons are strictly forbidden on campus. They want to remind students that if they bring a weapon onto campus, they're subject to that same felony charge given out to both suspects yesterday. Coming up at 6, I'm going to have more from students who were inside when those shots were fired. In Greensboro, Elijah Skipper, Fox 8 News.